What's up everyone and welcome back to the farm. Now today is just an odd, odd job day. Say hi to the turkeys. Anyways, I was saying uh, it's odd job day. Anyways, so I'm first going to clean the windows on the 1070 because as you can tell they're quite disgusting. So anyways, I'm going to do that and then I don't know what else I'll have time for uh, per se. Uh, need to get the hay trailer out, but first I need to clean up my truck in order to do that. So, uh, and also if I have time, we'll uh, probably look at the three-point sprayer that I keep talking about but never end up going and doing. So, anyways, so I'll let you watch me clean the windows of the 1070 because it needs it. So, anyways, I'll do that. Such a world of a difference. You can actually see out of the windows. And as far as I can remember, these two windows in this corner always had dirt on them. This one wasn't always near as bad because you always get it out from this side, but still, I haven't seen it that clean. They obviously could still use some more work. Of course, the inside of this cab needs some work because we need to open up the top and redo the seal on top. And we really like to put a new fan blower in here. Of course, with as much water that's been getting in here, I'm sure everything needs looked over as far as wiring because i'm sure it's bad also this corner window it's always been dirty same as here see out such a world of a difference i'm pretty happy i'll have to tell my dad that when he gets home that he needs to climb up in this thing and take a look because man it's amazing what small little differences do. It's crazy. Well, now that I got the glass clean, now I'm going to move the 1070 back over to its uh, little home for now, out of the way. And then that would open up, being able to drive through here a little more easily. Anyways, so that's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna work on cleaning out my truck try to get uh, all the stuff out of the back of the truck that's uh, not needed there like I got some dead limbs from my yard there in town get it down here to our burn hole and then I got some ramps in the back that need to come out because my tiller is out here and uh, yeah just some other random stuff that needs to come out and then I need to clean out the inside of my truck to try to get some of the trash and junk out anyways so that's what I'm gonna do now Full.
Well, that's going to do it for trash anyways. I could still get some more, but I'm going to call it quits for now. And run down to my grandparents to the shed to uh, get some measurements for hoses and uh, see if I can find a part number on the fan that goes on the back of it. Uh, anyways, try to get some information, get it written down, and see how they're doing, of course, and then we'll go from there. Well, here's our three-point sprayer. It don't look the greatest. It needs some work, but we're going to try to get it going. We do have a couple of pumps for it, but we're going to try to get it going. 100 gallon capacity. So hopefully we can get quite a bit done. Day. So today we are going to be hauling the portable panels that my dad has to the pasture. They're here in the lot uh, so we'll have to get them loaded up onto the trailer here and then get them down there and get them set up because dad wants to get the bull that he had borrowed uh, back to the guy that uh, he got it from or borrowing it from. So hopefully we can get that done this weekend. Um, so anyways, uh, first off I'm going to water the turkeys and then I'm going to go down to my grandparents house and see if they're there because I was trying to catch up with them yesterday and they weren't there. So anyways. <laughs>
kommunikere til. yesterday but uh, towards the afternoon but we got the wool loaded up, got them over to where he belongs, like he was on it. And then on the way home we had a little tire go flat, hence why this might tire can't get that back feed off. So we're gonna take it to a tire shop here Saturday so we only got one choice. Hopefully they can fix this up.
we're gonna try to straighten up the points on here because they kind of got bent. So we're gonna use that come along over there. Try to straighten these up. Put it on time lapse for you so you can watch. up here so we're gonna try to get things off and then try to get a list of things <laughs>